Well, Wichita Falls is also welcoming visitors from, visitors from near and far for the Triple H weekend. Tyshin Dawson caught up with some of those visitors. So Tyshin, how has their experience been in Wichita Falls so far? Daryl, many riders have already started indulging in the activities both in the off-field, uh, off-road races and the consumer show. And everybody that I spoke with said that they are excited for what the weekend has in store. The riders have hit their marks and are ready to get off to a good start. Game on. <laughs> for many riders like Sean Smith and Jordan Zimmerman from Kansas, this isn't their first ride. Uh, off and on since, for me, about 2009. This is a huge event. It's amazing to start with whatever thousands and thousands of riders all at the same time. It's super well supported. There's sag stops everywhere so you can get refreshed during the ride. Um, and it's just really fun to be out here with other people doing kind of the same thing. Brandon Sheehan traveled from Kansas and says his friend told him about this event 16 years ago and says he hasn't regretted it since. And he's like, you got to do this ride. He said, you got to do this. It's incredible. And uh, we came down here and he was right. It, it, it is an amazing ride. I think it's one of the best events. I've been doing a lot of rides for like 30 years and this is probably the best event I've ever been to. Sheehan says the support of the community is what makes it so special. Fred and Hilda Garcia share the same opinion. And the hospitality is the best in the world. And the expo. The bicycle expo is really good inside and in the ride. There's so many people. You meet so many people from all over. And it's just a really nice... The starting line is a blast. Inside the expo, I caught up with Rob Strange, who's been coming since 1998. My parents got us involved in the ride As riders pedal into the weekend, one thing is clear. Hotter in Hell is a showcase of the city's hospitality and beauty. And we want to remind everybody that safety is the number one priority, so be mindful and wear the proper protection. The Consumer Show will be open all weekend if you need some last-minute supplies. Wow, it is such a great tradition, such a long and great tradition. Wichita should be very proud of it, too. Tyshin, thank you so much for that.